Cancer, welcome to Tarot Alignment with Melanie and Melanie. Oh, okay. So this is um, where you're at right now. You're kind of feeling this anxiety. You can set yourself free and go forward. I think what's happening here is that you're in this energy if you want to move. You want to start doing things and you're keeping yourself trapped. Okay. What's in the past? Well, okay. What's in the past is that you've just left something that you needed a lot of strength for. Um, and not, you've tamed the beast within you. You've tamed the situation and now it's calm and you want to go forward. Okay. What's above you? the Knight of Cups. You want to offer your love to someone. You're feeling like it's spring and you want to give your love to somebody. That's what you're feeling. And I think that's why you want to go forward. And it's possible that you get, tried to give your love to somebody and it was rejected and that put you in that Eight of Swords. And now you're moving on. And now you're trying to find love. Eight of Wands. And there's going to be a lot of communication coming towards you from your person, whoever your person is. <sighs> That's in the near future. What's grounding you? The hermit is what's grounding you. It's just a lot of thinking and going within. What's this one? Yeah. The Hierophant. Yeah. You may be working on your own spirituality, going within, feeling <sighs> your own Zen. Okay. Let's see how your person feels about you. The person that you have in mind. How does your person feel about you? What's going on with them? What's going on with Cancer's person? The moon. You may be dealing with a water energy. They're in the Seven of Wands mode. They're, they're going within. They're thinking of themselves and their position. They're thinking about it very logically. Using their intuition about this offer of love. But they want it to grow. They definitely want the relationship to grow. And they want a new beginning. That's how they're feeling. Let's see how you're feeling. I mean, this is just kind of like where you're at right now. But how are you feeling? The Emperor. You're kind of standing strong with your beliefs, with your, um, you're kind of staying put. You have love, you have one toe forward. So that's a step forward. And you also 
are very temp you're kind of being a temptress and the cards are upside down and you're being very seductive and when you do talk to this person you're being very seductive and you're being a, a temptress I want to say which is kind of funny for a cancer to be a temptress but you're using your worldly ways to tempt this person yeah and there's the chariot which is interesting because with the chariot I'm um you're it's solid and you're divinely guided by this person you know the the chariot has stars above his chariot and that means when he's going forward he's doing it um by this divine guidance of knowing that this is the person and that's where you're coming from you just know it and you could have had past lives with this person yeah the seven of swords <sighs> The Seven of Swords is like, it's like a thief. It's like a thief, but in this case, because you're divinely guided, you just, you're just going in. You're, you're putting it out there and taking risk because a thief has to take risk. And I think you're taking risk. The bottom of the deck. Yeah, it's the Ten of Cups and the Star. And the three of wands, which means that this, you probably, there's a lot of traveling to get to this person. Eight of swords, a lot of communication. Who's at the bottom of the deck of your person? Yeah, they see you as a, the ten of pentacles. They see you as family. They're swiftly going to change their mind and, and make a move. And they're going to put temperance to this. They're going to balance it out. Yeah. Let's um, do some feeling cards. So when you do talk to this person, you kind of get a better idea of, you know, this temperance. And, you know, that there's something hidden. And this could be something that they're hiding and they're not telling you the whole story. And that's why you need the strength. And that's why there needs to be communication. And you wanting to move forward. But they seem to be... Okay. Beauty. They think you're beautiful. Parental. They think that you would be a good mate. And they contentment they feel content being around you and they're ready to have an involvement with you and let's do some no so if you had a question about this person, the answer is no. Hmm. No, they may not be ready. But it's the real deal. And it'll come in divine timing. So it may not happen now. But, um, you know, keep yourself open. Because this person does care for you. And they're just, there's things that are going on. And it could possibly have to do with money. But they do want a beginning with you. Okay. All right, Cancer. That was your love weekend reading. Please like and share. And get back with me. All right. Build my channel. Okay, take care. Bye-bye.